Hey peaches, welcome back to my channel. Today was a mall day with my mom. This was some delicious spinach dip, lots of dill. Don't worry though, I filmed this video a couple days ago before I got my COVID results. This was happier times for sure. This was my lunch with them, my auntie and my mom, crispy broccoli, some french fries, and the dip. We all split it three ways, and then I filmed this video wrong on accident, but I had a third of a burger. So good. Let's get into the shopping. This is one of my favorite stores. It's called Aritzia. It is so expensive, so definitely kind of a treat yourself store. I tried on these two little back dresses, the jeans and the shirt. This shirt I loved. I was gonna pick it up. I actually regret not getting it but that's okay. These jeans did not fit, nor did they make my butt look cute, but that is okay. Now, someone needs to tell Aritzia to get better lighting for selfies and video. This black dress was cute, but not $120 cute. This dress as well, and I guess I need to start bringing Spanx with me when I go try on dresses just to see what it would look like when I go out because I do wear Spanx with my dresses. Now I went to American Eagle after and I feel Aritzia can tell American Eagle about lighting. First I tried on these mom jeans and oh my god these were not flattering. It reminds me of that song by Beach Bunny. These jeans right here fulfill my 70s dream fantasy. They make my butt look so nice. I love, love, love the bell bottom look so much. These are a size 14, which makes me quite happy being that last year I was a size 12, so that's not too bad of an increase and hopefully I can get down a little more. Now these were the low rise versions. They were still cute, just not as cute. I'm surprised that these were considered low rise because they seemed pretty mid to high rise for me <laughs> because low rise I always consider almost butt hanging out pants. Now this was me exiting the store Store. I love, love, love American Eagle. If you are a plus size girl or a mid size girl, or you have a mid size or plus size girlfriend, this is the spot. Hey, Peaches, how are you doing? The clips you just saw were filmed a little bit ago when I was not so under the weather, <laughs> but I just wanted to get this video out there and show off what I got, what I ended up getting. Now, I also wanted to briefly talk about my body issues, especially with jean shopping. I was so proud of myself that when those jeans at Aritza didn't fit me, I didn't freak out or feel bad about myself. I think it helped because those jeans weren't really cute to begin with. <laughs> But I usually would beat myself down about not fitting into a pair of jeans, and today I didn't. So that was a good step in the right direction. I think it also helped that American Eagle is so wonderful and size inclusive. I believe they go up to a size 20 in store, and while I know there are bigger people than a size 20 out there, that is quite size inclusive considering most stores only go up to about a 10 to a 12 where I live. Let's get into it. First off, I got this super duper expensive skincare. I pray it works or else this is getting returned. Oh, lovely assistant. Can you help me open this? Thank you. In the meantime, well, that is getting opened. I'm going to show off. I got these American Eagle bell bottom jeans in a size 14, which is a 32 inch waist. The pockets are a little aesthetically ripped, 
which isn't my choice, but it is not too bad considering some ripped jeans are just intensely stupid. It has a ton of pockets too, including this little pocket right here, which I call the dime bag pocket or the coke pocket <laughs> when I was doing substances, of course. I want to show off this skincare. Like I said, this is super expensive. Um, it is Japanese skincare. I have this mask right here, which is specialized treatment. Then I have the facial treatment clear lotion, which acts as an exfoliant. So I'm going to be using this twice a week to start off with. The lady at the store told me I should use it twice a day, but I definitely think that's just marketing to get me to use up the product more and then buy it back sooner if I like it. Then I have this amazing essence, which will add extra hydration. So I am super excited to try this out. It felt great on my skin, no reaction. Everyone at Sephora was so nice. Of course, they are salespeople, but they were complimenting my skin and it felt nice to be acknowledged for something I do actually work quite hard at in terms of being up with my sunscreen usage. Wear your dang sunscreen. <laughs> okay, we're definitely gonna be doing a skincare video soon, an updated one. And I would love to do a video doing skincare on my boyfriend, who is the most low maintenance guy with his appearance, except his beard. He does spend, in my opinion, an ungodly amount of time in his beard, but it does look very and nice. My hygiene. And your hygiene, but he, uh, I mean low maintenance though. Like, yes, you do spend a lot of time on your hygiene, but it isn't excessive. Anyways, then we got also this jogger sweatpants. They're mainly for Colton, but this is a good thing about being kind of fat that I can fit into my boyfriend's clothes. <laughs> I know there's women out there that are bigger than their boyfriends and rock that for sure. I just typically haven't been the same size as my boyfriend ever. So the fact that I am, I'm trying to look at as a positive that we could share clothes. As he commented, he wanted to try on my bell bottom jeans until I told them they were high waisted. <laughs> Anyways, peaches, thank you so much for being here and supporting me. Love you all. Have a great rest of your night. Stay peachy, stay hydrated, and stay safe because the 19 is still flying around and hitting everyone in my life right now. So be extra precautious.